Boeing up 750. Uh, and as Boeing goes, the Dow goes. And I'm just going to make a statement on Boeing real quick. Uh, let's call it uh, March, April, May, June, July, August, September. Seven to eight month trading range, tightening up recently, no volume yet. But I got a sneaking suspicion this thing's going to bust out of this big range here and we're going to lead to higher prices in the Dow. We'll see. The old high was 374.48. The high of July was 364.50 closed one dollar below it but you were above it earlier today would love to see some big volume on there earnings are not till october 23rd uh, also in the dow uh, caterpillar almost three home depot two and a half 3m nike nike new closing high <laughs> colin kaepernick thing meant nothing <laughs> in fact sales went up i guess it's the cool thing you know, let's kiss the butt of somebody who wears socks depicting police as pigs and glamorizing the Castros. Let's love this man. Uh, also up today in the Dow, Visa, United Tech, Travelers, Microsoft, Goldman Sachs, those are dollar gainers on the downside. Really nothing. Yeah, nothing. S&P up 15, NASDAQ up 60, but was up, I think, 87 at one time. NASDAQ 100 up 58, SOX up 11, was up 20, I think. Transport's up 46. Now, here's something weird. More new lows than new highs on both major indices. Huh. Haven't looked at it yet, but more new lows than new highs. The only thing I'm thinking, though, the bond market continues to get hit, and maybe there's some bond funds in there. During the next break, I'll take a look. Uh, but interest rates, 3.048 on the 10-year. Uh, uh, looking at the chart of the 10-year, if it ever does come up, eh, you're above the high of July. You're not above the high of uh, May, which looks like about 3.15, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, what else did I see today in the uh, fabulous market? Uh, just, just a good tone all day and listen carefully we're still in that kind of sort of rally mode off the lows of the worst stuff remember for a very long while we've been telling you avoid 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 the china and all that stuff well overall big picture we still have a rally in what i call a bearish market could the low be in of course it can but usually they'll retest it a few We'll see. That goes for commodities. That goes for gold and silver and the like. Remember, a lot that's been going on is you've had a very strong dollar. The dollar has been weakening. When the dollar drops, these commodity and commodity type countries go up. Also, when the dollar drops, you get better action out of the multinationals. Our multinationals. You know, we don't like talking currency too much because it puts us to sleep. But when you have these moves of extremity, extremes, yeah, extremity is a word, of extremes, we got to make note of it.